subscribe and ring the bell to never miss an update. Hello everyone. Today on Lady Mary Bath, we're continuing our Goodwill series with a stop at the Goodwill Select location on Grant Road at Luetta. We found some great things here over the years. Lots of Waterford crystal, porcelain, fantastic collections. Let's discover some treasures together. This location on Luetta Road is a fan favorite. Many of you shop this store wherever you live across Houston, you know they've always got good stuff. And here's the address here on Luetta. I will link it in the video description. And now let's go on inside and discover some fantastic finds. It's been a while since I've been in this particular location. I've been in Germany for part of the summer and was really busy before we left. So this will be interesting to see what's new. And the color of the week is yellow. Let's get started. The color of the week can certainly help with your buying decisions. At the end of this week, items are removed from the store and they are sent to the outlet center where you have to dig in the bins. And that is certainly not for the faint of heart. So I highly recommend grabbing it while you can, especially if it's the color of the week. They also have a lot of new items they sell, candy, sunglasses, greeting cards. That is a new focus for Goodwill, that impulse buying at the register. And behind the cashier station, they have a lot of valuable items, including handbags. I have narrowly missed some Brahmin over the years, have not been that fortunate, and some furnishings up front. And it changes every day. You never know what you'll find. So if you're in the market for a new bed, you want to pop in often because they do get these a lot. $99.99 for both pieces. And this is actually a newer but nicer set. You can certainly use a furniture pin to touch up. And here is a jewelry armoire in that golden oak. It has great storage. It is priced at $24.99, which is a very good price. Here you can hang your necklaces on the side. It is a magnetic door. Perhaps you could even paint that. And some more golden oak. This is actually a really good deal for six chairs and oak table. American made, as you will see. And always look underneath a table. That's where you have some more information. $124.99 is an excellent price. Very sturdy. And look for that tag underneath. It is made in the USA from the Cochrane Furniture Company in Lincolnton, North Carolina. And here's a hall tree with mirror. That's quite nice with an umbrella stand. It is near the register. I think it has sold. And lots of clothing as well, but I'm looking for accessories and giftware today. And here is a very familiar Vera Bradley. These are great. Wonderful quality, fun colors. This happens to be the Deco Daisy and very well priced. And you can use this for anything. I like to keep tote bags in my car too. You never know when you will need them for shopping. Wonderful interior. This Vera Bradley tote bag is a deal at $8.99. It is machine washable. You just reach inside, pull out that insert, and then replace it after washing. These go for about $75 on the Vera Bradley website and in their stores. I'm always looking for a carry-all for Germany because you have to bring your shopping bags with you wherever you go. It's always worth a look in this Treasure Island area. They don't have a separate department, but these cases over the years have held some amazing treasures. And fabrics, that is something I don't often see. Someone has obviously donated their collection, perhaps even a local store. This would be perfect for so many projects, and I'll tell you some ideas that I have. $12.99 for the entire bolt of fabric, that is an incredible deal. And we have quite a variety here. 
It's nice to see all these rolls of fabric. This, I believe, is from Calico Corners. It coordinated in the 90s with the popular Queensland Crimson pattern. And for a solid color like this that mimics a Dupioni silk, this would be a great idea to place over a backing or board inserted inside your china cabinet, teacup cabinet, curio cabinet, anything you've got. And it adds a luxurious look and some lighter background. $9.99, possibilities are endless. It's always worth looking in these cases. You might find a great Christmas gift. This is made from the Linux company, $4.99, very well priced. Another example of a China manufacturer that got in on the metalware after Wilton Armitel made it so popular with brides. That pop of color with the red ribbon is perfect. You could add some homemade treats and gift it to a friend or neighbor for the holidays. Nativity collections, you do see these year round. I have a friend that has a collection of at least a dozen and she does display them in her cabinet throughout the year. A bit unusual that these are individually priced. I find that odd, but perhaps they were worried a piece would get separated. You could certainly purchase the entire set. You can tell this piece is a bit modern. It is not part of that nativity set and it is certainly a standalone. Madonna, the mother and child. As always, we'll turn it over and look for a back stamp. It is made by the Inesco company, priced at $3.99. They are also the makers of Precious Moments collectibles. And here's the other half of the nativity set. And it looks to be complete. And that white would go with just about any decor, modern or traditional. Glassware is plentiful at Goodwill. So many uses for these and think about gifting as well. And this pattern you might remember. You probably recognize this pattern with that pressed star and fan design. It is called Prescott, appropriately named from the Anchor Hawking Company. It was launched in 1960, it is now discontinued, and you see this in just about every shape and size. It's very affordable in the secondary market, great for that vintage vibe at $3.99. It's always worth looking through the candle holders. Sometimes you find a large collection that was used for an event or wedding. And here's something new in a box. I've actually seen these many times before, but never in the original packaging. And surprisingly, I see these at antique shops. It's quite nice. And that would make a great gift as well. Just wrap it up for the holidays. Candle holders are usually priced separately because they could go missing and perhaps be placed in different areas of the store. And that's one more reason to look in every department. $3.99 each. They are quite lovely. You could certainly give these with some beautiful beeswax candles in any fun color. Home decor, even bathroom accessories, they have it all. And I always take time to go through this section because you never know what you'll find. And there is an item that I'm very excited about. My heart is racing. I'm thinking this could be Waterford Crystal. It is priced at $5.99 and it is placed on top of two bowls it looks like. Always remove the tape and be doubly sure. And I'm going to do so right now and big disappointment. It has a hollow base. Waterford Crystal does not have that and you can tell it is glass it's not crystal but at first glance it was hard to know because it was taped together. You could save for some thrifting with this piggy bank. From Yellowstone National Park. How about that old faithful? This fan dish might be from Avon. It's something I've seen often, $2.99. Perfect for the vanity or for placing some after dinner mints. Chocolate truffles. Even as a holder for a sugar and creamer. And of course, I'm always looking for Waterford. That usually comes out on the carts, but I have found pieces here before on the shelf just waiting for me, including a cake plate. This piece is definitely glass. It is not crystal. We'll talk more about this. This oval dish is most likely EAPG, Early American Pattern Glass. 
for $5.99. It's a fair price. It is definitely not American Brilliant. You can tell it doesn't have the sparkle. The cuts are not deep. It is pressed glass. A teal ruffled vase is quite the statement piece. This would be incredible for a buffet. If you're wanting to make a splash at your next soiree, it's definitely worth a look. And the cobalt is always a favorite. And as we turn it over, we see it is from a florist, perhaps a grocery store. Originally $12.99 from the Fresh Floral Department, probably Kroger. A familiar Fostoria Colony Bowl. This is one of my favorite shapes. I love the swirl pattern. You could place this on top of a pedestal. It could be a centerpiece base. Simply put fruit inside. So many different purposes. And a large surface area. I absolutely love this piece. I don't have more space for this. That's why I'm going to leave it for someone else. But certainly a great price under $10. And even better, $6.99, wow. Shannon Crystal is made by the Godinger Company. And that's a company that does a very good job of sort of recreating the looks from major manufacturers at $9.99. That's a fair price for a larger centerpiece bowl. It's certainly not Waterford Crystal, even though you see it mimics the design. Mostly made in Slovenia today. And actually Waterford makes a lot in the same country. They have a 350 year history of artisans in Slovenia. Pictures are always perfect for entertaining. I featured this in a segment and it gives you some ideas of how you can turn that $5.99 picture into a great gift. I like those blue canisters. And something new in a box. Love all the colors here. And it really is ready to go if you could just remove all that tape. Fantastic gift presentation. This is a high-end gift boutique item, a set of demitasse or espresso cups and saucers. Well packaged. It is from the classic coffee and tea company, priced at $12.99. I have seen similar items for $50 and up, and this is a fair price. We make a great gift. A perfect tea set for a little girl for serving lemonade and cookies with her friends. I started this tradition when I was about three years old, and I still enjoy tea with my friends today. You never know what you'll find here in the dish section. My friend Lydia was lucky enough to score an entire set of Johnson Brothers Victorian Christmas for about $35. We'll take a look at a very high-end restaurant porcelain company. This is from England. The Steelite International Company provides to some of the top restaurants with Michelin stars. $6.99 for a stack of bowls. That's a great deal to elevate your table. And this brand I was not familiar with until I started following my take on Home and Garden. And Robert Stanley is a Hobby Lobby brand. And our friends there create beautiful tables. I encourage you to pop over to their channel, my take on Home and Garden. Collector's plates can be fun. I can add just a bit of whimsy on a bookshelf. And Georgia is always on my mind. My parents lived in the Atlanta area and found some great items there at Southern Comforts, it's a consignment shop, and Queen of Hearts Antique Mall in Alpharetta. United Nations, that's a fantastic plate. You could even create a beautiful bracelet or pendant. Lots of different options. This was part of a tiered tray. You see the holes there. And you could certainly order those parts online. And Tennessee. Absolutely love this great state. My father and stepmother live in Franklin. And I have shared many antique shops and thrift stores throughout the years. Well priced at $1.99. Another stack of restaurant plates. It is not steel light from England. It is Lens China. It is stoneware that is made in China. Very sturdy, more of a diner compared to the high-end restaurant that we saw with the steel light. And very heavy. And speaking of heavy, I'm always looking for the metal. And this bowl is well loved, but it does have a great back stamp. Look at that, it is Nambe from New Mexico. They make some incredible items, candle holders, 
vases, bowls, platters. It's a wonderful brand. I highly recommend that you look out for that when you're out thrifting or at a local antique shop. And lots of pots and pans, tea kettle. They have everything at Goodwill. Got some ceramic pitchers, lots of kitchenware. If you have white dishes and you want to add a pop of fun, this would be a great carafe or pitcher. You could tie that with some colorful ribbons to add interest. It is made in Italy, priced at $5.99. Could certainly have fun with this red teapot. It's an interesting shape as well. $5.99, looks to be in great condition, and it is Chantal. That is a wonderful brand. You could create an interesting gift package with these ice cream bowls priced at $11.99. Pair it with some cones, a scoop, some sprinkles. And one item that stands out here, of course, my favorite color, that classic blue utensil holder. Let's look at the back stamp. It is from the Pampered Chef. Those are home party companies, $5.99. And that was probably 40 or 50 in the catalog. So that's a deal. Kitchen decor. This is something that was very popular in the 90s and it looks well preserved. I have found Waterford Crystal here over the years. That's why I'm always looking. And as I like to say, looking and lifting because you may see a back stamp. Fun margarita glasses. And that orange definitely goes with some school spirit colors. $1.99. Those are hand blown and that is a deal. I can even see desserts served in that glass. And for every day, these are lovely. Priced at $1.99 each from Studio, made in China. Has an interesting design. I can see orange juice in that for brunch. Pot holders that were lovingly made. These are so well priced. I should have picked these up 49 cents each and they look like they have a yellow sticker, I'm assuming, for the holidays. You could even place a teapot on top of that. Love it. Reminds me of my grandma. She did lots of crocheting. Heavy metals deserve a look. We might find something incredible here. This is a familiar design, but I'm not too sure of the patina. So we're going to uncover this and take a closer look and I find something familiar. You can probably guess at the company. One of my favorites, Wilton Armatel. Sometimes you can just spot craftsmanship in a pile of metalware. And this I thought could be Wilton Armatel. I could tell by the design and I love anything with Holly. And sure enough, it is Wilton Armatel. And here the die says the Wilton Company, which means that it's even older than I thought. This might be from the early 1980s. And the Wilton Armatel Company got its start in Pennsylvania in 1892. It is a metal alloy. It is non-toxic, food safe, great for entertaining. One of my very favorite finds of the day, I actually did purchase this. It is the William and Mary pattern from Wilton Armatel, one of my two bridal selections. I chose flutes and pearls along with this pattern, $11.99. And I can tell you, we use this every night with our dinner service for hamburgers, any kind of chicken dish that we make. And you can also heat it up so that your food stays warm. Very practical, purposeful, and one of the best things I've bought lately. Absolutely, hands down, and it is quite beautiful. Such detail with that pattern. And actually easy to clean. And now let's take a look at these. That has a 25th anniversary in the center. I'll pass on that. And these, I need to take a closer look. I'm not quite ready for that. A little bit of a surprise there. Made in Hong Kong, and it's not the quality I expected. This trio of silver plated trays is something that I'm definitely going to pass on. It mimics a Reed and Barton pattern that I have, so I had to take a closer look. It's not quite as heavy as I think it should be, and I did look at the back stamp, and it is silver plated in Hong Kong, and I can tell it doesn't have quite the amount of silver for the plating. 
and it's not quite the quality. Of course, the price is right if you're looking for some entertaining essentials, but I'm going to pass on this. A trio of trays can be purposeful. It's just not the quality that I'm looking for, but hopefully someone will pick that up and enjoy it. These are items that are about to hit the floor. They have quite a few of these summer posy square placemats. Of course, you could just use one and put it under a centerpiece. You don't have to have the entire set. And I can see that poolside as well. Kind of reminds me of the 1970s with that green. Love it. And I see some carts in the background. We need to take a closer look. It's always worth looking inside these carts because you never know what you'll find. A lot of water for crystal that I have acquired over the years has come from this store in these carts. A chafing dish, which of course is very practical. And a high-end backpack with a surprise logo. A practical find for $4.99. This is an OGO brand backpack. These go for about 150 to 200 and up on Amazon. And that is a real find, especially with my husband's company logo, Hewlett Packard Enterprise. And now he can pack up his supplies for work and he's definitely upgraded already. This will be a nice surprise for him. You might even find an air filter, practical items at Goodwill and a pattern that is quite familiar to me. So happy to see this sugar bowl. I'll tell you more about it. And China Baroque actually has two pendants in this pattern and you might figure out how they got the China to make those pendants. I'll tell you more in just a bit from Homer Laughlin. They have more pieces, but I'm only interested in the sugar bowl and the creamer. You can see the gold rim there. These are delightful bowls. And of course, a creamer can be used for serving syrup, salad dressing, flowers, just about anything. A delightful find. It was definitely worth cart diving. And now I have a replacement sugar bowl. I originally purchased this at Heights Antique Mall, you may have seen in a previous segment. And unfortunately, one of my cats broke the bowl. The lid did survive, so now I've got a replacement and a bonus creamer. Delighted to have these for $2.99 each. Homer Laughlin Magnolia was made from 1951 to 1954 in a variety of styles, even though it's the same pattern. And this detailing up top means that it is the Georgian collection. I like that embellishment, and that is just one more reason to take home this sugar roll. Cart diving requires some digging, but it's still easier than shopping the Goodwill bins. And I find pineapple art. This would be perfect for poolside if you have a covered area. The tulip arrangement sold very quickly. A lady was anxious to take this home for her sunroom. And of course, when I see tulips, I think of our friends in the Netherlands. And I encourage you to join us on our Facebook group page, Lady Mary Best Table, where we have viewers from all over the world that share their thrifted finds and beautiful tables, including from the Netherlands. I stood in line in 2017 and paid $50 for this cap. What a deal at $2.99. I have great appreciation for cross stitch. Folk art is not what I'm looking to add. I will let someone else pick that up for $3.99. I'm always looking through the jewelry because you never know what you'll find. They have mostly fashion or costume. I have heard rumors over the years that occasionally a piece of James Avery or 14 karat will slip through. It is worth a look and we find some China earrings in that classic blue and white. They do have a lot of games as well. Not something I'm in the market for, but always looking might find a diamond in the rough or a beautiful crystal vase. This could be Mikasa. Price at $6.99. It's a lovely, almost tulip shape. I have found water for crystal here as well in the vase section, including my Aragon pattern. That's a lovely clear crystal vase. And these are made of paper. If you're hosting an event, you want to check your local Goodwill because you find multiples. Always something to discover. It's been a fun day shopping this Goodwill Select store. And I met a viewer, Jan, who has started a blue and white chinoiserie collection. After she saw my birthday video, she was inspired and she's quite the Goodwill shopper. I'm bringing home a surprise for my husband with that OGO company logo backpack. 
Vera Bradley tote bag for my European shopping. This Wilton Armitel Christmas plate is perfect for holiday entertaining Christmas cookies too. My favorite find of the day, this Homer Laughlin Magnolia Creamer and Sugar with that Georgian detailing. Thanks again for joining Lady Mary Beth. Elevate your everyday with Goodwill Shopping.